Hey there, what's going on? I'm Rich Demuro with CNET TV in New York City, and this is The Q, keeping you current with the tech lifestyle. Since it's spring, we decided to take the show outside. First dry candy, online casino Golden Palace at it again, this time putting the Pope Mobile back on the auction block. The car broke eBay records with 10 million hits in 2005. It once belonged to current Pope Benedict XVI before he was Pope. The original seller didn't realize the car's previous owner until he checked the registration. Proceeds from the auction go to charity. Browsing the web on a mobile device can be a frustrating experience, especially if a site doesn't optimize. But DeepFish wants to change that. Code name for Microsoft's new mobile web browser, Lightweight DeepFish leverages server-side technology, displaying content in a familiar desktop format without any extra work from the site's creator. The software is still in deep development. You can try fishing around for a beta invite. Juiced, the video product that hopes to merge the best of TV and the web, now has a cool new commercial. It takes all the magical bits of television and the even better bits from the internet and mixes them together so you can watch what you want, when you want, in full screen, high quality, proper TV. The full commercial on Juiced's website, I'm waiting for the behind the scenes footage on how they made it. So now that you're planning on ditching TV for Juiced, what to do with that big screen? Consider going ambient. Taking a nod from the holiday Yule log, ambient DVDs turn your flat panel into much more. A growing trend in one company has a bunch of the roughly $20 discs, good conversation starters at parties, and it sure beats a blank screen. There are ambient DVDs displaying everything from flowers to sunsets, kittens to puppies. The most popular? Fireplace, Aquarium, and Art. Finally, the trailer for the latest Grand Theft Auto video game making the rounds, and it seems to have New York City officials controller wires in a tangle. While fictionalized, the trailer clearly shows a city modeled after the Big Apple. The mayor's office, quoted by the AP, is saying they don't support any video game where you earn points for injuring or killing police officers. The police commissioner saying it's despicable to glamorize violence. Grand Theft Auto 4 on shelves in October. And this just in, New York City is also asking Law & Order, which is actually filmed here, to stop the killing. There are many ways to tell us what you think about the show. You can email us, it's theq at cnet.com. You could also leave us a voicemail. There's the special phone number on the screen. If it's interesting enough, we may even use it on the show. I'm Rich Samiro, New York City. Thanks for watching. Don't say I didn't tell you so.